Hey guys, welcome back to another Helix video. So today we're looking at another new AMP model in the 3.6 firmware update for Line 6 Helix. This one's an original Line 6 model, which is great. I love their original models. Those guys do amazing work. Um, up until actually this firmware, Litigator was pretty much all I use. Um, the Grammatico is kind of inching ahead a little bit. Um, but this one is a Line 6 Elmsley. Uh, I kind of had to get through about a week of playing with the Grammatico to take some time to sit down with this one. And um, it didn't take long, honestly. Uh, you'll see as I'm showing you what I've done to it, which is practically nothing but pull the amp model up. Um, it's very dynamic. It feels good to play. Uh, responds well to the dynamics you're playing. You know, you're rolling back on the volume knob, your pickup, you know, position and selection. Um, it, it's just, it's great. It feels really, really good. So, um, basically this preset is going to be free. The link will be in the description below. It's going to be up on custom tone. So if you like it, grab it. Basically it's the Elmsley. It got a tube screamer, a cab block, uh, delay, compressor reverb. It's all pretty standard stuff. The main thing here is the Elmsley and I pulled it up and the only thing that was uh, different that I've done is I've adjusted the channel volume and a bu bumped up the drive a little bit. When I pulled it up, it was all fives except for the masters on 10. Just for the sake of, in my opinion, showing how good this amp model is, I'm not going to touch anything. Um, I'm just not. It sounds good. Like I said, I bumped the drive up a little bit and I'm happy. So for me, when you don't have to touch a thing, it just sounds good. Adjust the volume to taste, adjust the drive to taste. That's a good app model. So anyway, I'm going to do a quick demo just to let you hear um, what it sounds like. I'm going to be, I'm using my Variac. So what you're going to be hearing is a Strat neck uh, position, then a Strat bridge with a P90 pickup. So a little more of an overdrive tone from that. Um, I'm going to start uh, on the neck with volume back, back down just a little bit. So you can kind of hear, uh, you know, hear the difference when I play light to heavy. And as I roll up, you'll hear it kind of gets to that edge of breakup kind of thing. And when you want to go a little farther, that's where the tube screamer comes in. All right. So here are the sounds. <laughs> You can hear um, on the bridge position, it's got a pretty good growl to it. And, you know, just flip it back, turn the volume up knob down a little bit to the negative. You know, really good dynamic range with that. Um, gives me a lot of options, which is changing pickup position. So... Let's see what happens if we sweeten the deal a little bit uh, with the tube screamer again, starting on the neck position. So as you would expect, this is, uh, well, as you can see, the Tube Screamer is mainly pushing level, pushing harder into the front end of the amp model, not adding a lot of gain on its own, just driving the amp a little harder. Um, uh, and it just, again, just adds a little more to the gain stage. <laughs> It just sounds good. Uh, if we go back to the neck for a little more bluesy stuff. <laughs> it just sounds good. It feels good. It's got good dynamic range. Required zero tweaking. <laughs> 
<laughs> Zero tweaking. Um, here's the cab block I use just if you want to see. Matchless with the 57, the 1x12 cream with the U67. I kind of like this approach of a close mic dynamic mic in combination with uh, a condenser just a little bit off. Uh, kind of, to me, that fills out the spectrum. The dynamic gets more your high end. The, the, um, the condensers pick it up more the well, the rounded sound. So anyway, like I said, this preset is for free. The link is in the description below. If you'll do me a favor, click subscribe thumbs up, notification bell, all that good stuff. That's all I ask. Um, in addition to those fun free things, I do also have presets on the Line 6 Marketplace for Var Variax and Helix. If you are interested in those, it is a great way to support the channel and you will see those links below. As always, thanks for checking out the content and until next time, we'll see you.